my channel and it's another hair tutorial another crochet braid tutorial I do not do cornrows my mom is always the one well by far who has been doing my cornrows I don't know the pattern of cornrow braids and shoot I don't know how to cornrow at all so Sam's Beauty sent me some hair and I wanted to try the Ocean Wave the brand of this one is called Authentic African braid collection. I use the majority of the colors P430. I got just one pack of the number four just so I can put in the back. And the majority of my head I have the, the mix. So this is what it looks like. This is this is what the packaging looks like. Oh my. Okay, got it in P430. I used four packs of these. Four packs and it did me it did me fine now what I will say <laughs> is that I did not like the hair when I was done I was kind of scared I kept thinking to myself that I was gonna take it out right away and um, correct me if I'm wrong because I'm not a hairstylist I'm not a natural hairstylist I'm not none of that stuff we already know that I do my hair because I'm tender-headed and I like to believe that I have patience to do my own hair. Not everybody has the patience to do it. I didn't like it at first because I tried to straighten it and it fried my hair. I straight barbecued my hair, y'all. So good thing I had some more hair. I was able to put some in. Any whoms. Oh yeah, so I was saying, correct me if I'm wrong. It's Konecalon and Toyokalon. Let me look that up in the dictionary. <laughs> So to my understanding, that means that you can straighten the hair. Oh my gosh, I'm about to get butchered right now, ain't I? I don't even know if I should put that in the clip. From what I've been told, you can straighten this kind of hair. But maybe I'm wrong. But like I said, I'm not a hairstylist. I am not a hairstylist. I'm not a Cosmo. I'm a petition. So yeah, oh, this is what the texture of the hair looks like. It's textured. And I like that it's textured. It's not silky, you know, um, something a little bit more realistic. This is synthetic hair, but I like that it's very realistic because my, you know, um, African-American woman, black woman, my, my texture, my natural hair is not silky. Even when I relax my hair, it's still not silky. So I like the um, how realistic this is and um, how textured it is. I love it. Oh my gosh, did I tell you? I was gonna tell you that I did not like the way the hair came out towards the end. And of course, you're not gonna really know what the hair looks like until you put your makeup on your face, you know, you put the outfit on, play with the hair a little bit. I also chose to cut the hair. I put the length, you know, these are, uh, it's, uh, it's a 20 inch, and I just installed all of them. I installed the four packs of hair, and towards the end, at the end, I layered my hair, so I cut towards the end. Um, in the video, I show you a little bit of the cutting, but it's not too different from what I did from my last crochet braid tutorial using the Free Twist brand with the, the three patterns, the deep twist, presto, and go-go. Uh, the way that I cut the hair there is not too different from how I cut the hair here. I did it exactly this exactly the same and it didn't damage it look it's just um oh the way I have it right now is in a half up half down look here I love this hair it, it's giving me 90s it's giving me 90s you know with the loops you know it's, it's yeah it's just it's giving me it's it's, it's giving me all types and sorts of things I'm, I'm feeling this up half up half down look I love it my little sister likes it you like it baby you like it she was like she said it was cute so if she said it's cute it's cute what's that noise I promise I thought freaking gargantua was coming. I layered the hair and that wasn't hard for me to do. It was very easy, very, 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 very easy. And once I put on my makeup, once I put on my outfit and you know, got my whole fills of the hair, I fell in love with it. So it's not gonna be, um, I'm not gonna be taking it out tomorrow because when I didn't like it at first, I was thinking I'll just take it out tomorrow. <laughs> but I love it, so. I'm gonna stop talking guys and I'm just gonna let you watch the video, okay? Don't forget to like, comment, and if your brand stankin' new, okay? Like, comment, subscribe. So I'm actually gonna be starting out with the invisible knot method. Ooh, did I say it right? Okay, so I used the tool to bring it through my cornrow and I closed the latch once the hair was inside the little loop and I brought it back through. Then I let the latch go, released the hair, and now I'm creating 
three knots using only one side of that hair. Okay, and now I'm pulling it tight. To secure the knot, I like to create a tree braid. And basically what I do is pull smaller portions from the hair. I just do two knots, that's it. There's one knot, and then there is the second knot. Pull it tight, and that completes that one. I wonder if you wet it, would it go back to curly again? And so I didn't want to keep the hair at its regular length, so I just went in and layered it. Anyways, that completes this look. I hope you have enjoyed it, okay? Here is what it looks like on the first day that I completed it and the second day. I'll catch you in my next video. Love ya. Bye.